Why do you have to shout? What are you trying to do? Be like that loudmouth woman in Austin Powers who can't help but keep yelling all the time? Scott! Oh. Bring in the fanbots! The fanbots! Send in the guys! But then again, if just yelling is considered music by feminist standards, then I suppose I should not be shocked. so you could cook your hungry man steak dinners and you're just now getting around to my body. Are you talking about getting a tan because there's a beach for a reason, you know? Thanks, science! I've been coming since 2004! Just how old are you? You don't look any older than 17 or 18, which means you've been masturbating at the age of 8? And now, after 11 years, I finally know that is indeed what was happening. That just makes no fucking sense. I mean, it's just bullshit. I really want to make a counter argument, but I can't seem to think of one. And it's not because it's too difficult to debunk, but it's just the words are just too hard to come up with. Turns out! I'm not just a fertile animal who's meant to scream only during childbirth. Oh! Oh, me so stupid. And it turns out I've been breathing the wrong way. I've been breathing through my ass. And thanks, science, for discovering my orgasm and then giving me tips on how to keep having them. Like that time you suggested that I surround myself with men because they get competitive and work harder to please me, therefore resulting in a better climax. I don't know where you get your sources, but when science is backing things up with evidence, it might be just a slight suggestion that you may want to take their advice. Thanks, science, for assuming that I like to fuck men. So you're a lesbian. Not that I care, but what makes you think science is going to care about your sexuality? Where do you even get the conclusion anyway? Do you really think some German scientist like, Ah, and that's conclusive research. It is safe to assume that all women are hetero. Thanks, science, for pretending I haven't been fucking myself the right way since 2004. So science confirms the way you've been masturbating to be accurate. Good to know, right? Hey, science! Since it's 2015, are you now accepting women's opinions on the subject? Since when does science care about your opinion? Science is based off research, not whiny complaints. Dead hand. Hey, science! I'm gonna let you finish, but I just had the best orgasm of all time. You're gonna interrupt science now? Move out the way, facts and logic! Here comes feminism! And I think you could learn something. Hey what can science learn from a little girl who barely understands the grasp of the idea that science is based on by years of experimenting and rational conclusions? Perhaps science can help us study the feminist brains to see if brain waves or something. Something. Hey, science! I have a suggestion. How about instead of focusing your attention on whether or not I know how to get off, you take my word for it and put your energy towards more productive things. Like, hey, science, how about you invent a dildo that turns into a whisk so I can bake a cake afterward? I think it's a job for some inventor and not science in general. Don't get me wrong, if someone wants to make it, I would have no objection to it. Or how about a dishwasher safe dildo? One that's safe for me and also washes my dishes. I guess this explains why you're frustrated with science. Hey science, I need a vibrator that is also a taser for reasons that don't need explaining. Let me guess, you need your pussy to be shocked. Hey, science, how about you start hiring women instead of quoting Freud and calling it science? You act like there's no women in science whatsoever. 
fucking hell, I know more about science than you do, and I haven't been in school for years now. How about you let go of the necessity of the penis? How about you stop colonizing the vagina and recognize it discovered you? All hail to my vagina, I suppose. Dear Lord, your narcissism is off the roof! Hey, science! I need a health teacher that includes the clitoris in his lesson plan. I learned about the clitoris even before my health class. It's called porn! Hey, science! I need a boyfriend who doesn't consider masturbation a performance for him. So, wait a second. You're complaining about science assuming that you like to fuck boys, yet here you are complaining that your boyfriend is masturbating for his own pleasure. Or seeing other people masturbate. Or even seeing you masturbate for his pleasure. I think the only reason you're calling him your boyfriend, because he's not really your boyfriend, he's your slave. Your boy toy, if you will. If you masturbate and he enjoys it, that you're masturbating, then what right do you get to say that he should not enjoy it? Hey science, next time you do a study that results in an alarmingly low number of women who've had orgasms, how about you conduct a study on why men think their dicks are our fairy godfathers instead of assuming the problem lies with women? I think I understand what this woman is trying to say. She's basically venting out her frustration when her boy toy fails to please her. And then she tries her very best to act like a lesbian in front of her friends because men are the devil and women are the saints. Hey, science, it would be cool if you just, like, backed off for a minute. What, if science is knocking on your door now demanding they study your poor cock pocket? That's what we call your pussy. Hey, science, you should know I already did all of the experimenting for you. Because science apparently just recently discovered the female body, am I right? What planet are you from? Do you really think some scientists near this era are finally decided to study the female body? As you can see, the little penis goes into the little girl's cave that is called the clitoris, and there they make the babies. Like I get it. You discovered the female orgasm in 2014. So you admit that you believe that science has just recently studied the female body. I think we need to study the bodies of feminists, create a whole museum dedicated to feminist bodies, and explore the brain wavelengths to see how the feminists act compared to regular day, normal human beings. But I discovered the female orgasm during nap time, at sleepovers, in my parents' basement. You masturbated during nap time, and your parents' basement. It's official, you only care about what goes inside your cock pocket. And if it doesn't please you, well, blame it on something else. Under the bleachers, on the school bus, on top of many a bunk bed. Holy shit, you masturbated everywhere! You should go to jail for that! In the shower, the back seat, in the closet, out of the closet, during the she's all that makeover reveal scene, like science! Science! I blame you for making me this horny! Now stick your penis inside me, you little shit! I got this! Science! I got this! You can tell the people can't take her seriously because she's just yelling, Science! Science! Hey, Science! I'm talking to you in the most annoying way possible. I am the atheist gamer. Peace the game out.